channel or welcome back to my channel so today i am uh, gonna do something with myself that is yeah we we gotta get something going here so love Mew sent me a wig to try out this is actually my first time um working with them and i'm actually gonna be doing a five by five closure wig i don't know the last time i have done a closure unit it's clearly been over a year maybe like a year and a half it's been a second i don't hate closure units um they're very just straight to the point very basic extremely beginner friendly as well i don't hate them I just love to do, you know, a little bit more to my units versus only dealing with this much. So it has its benefits for a lot of people, especially today for me because I have had COVID and I'm kind of getting back into the swing of things. This is actually kind of coming in handy because I need to do something with myself, but I don't feel like doing the absolute most. So this is perfect. So this is their five by five unit it does have hd lace and it's in 30 inches and it's 180 percent density but i will put the exact detail the exact link to everything down in the description box for you guys um so that you'll have it. so first things first i went on ahead and plucked this unit a bit you guys just a bit right in the front because i felt like the hairline right there was just a little bit too bulky if you're a beginner don't be afraid to pluck your hairline especially when it's a five by five closure unit it's much easier you don't have to deal with all the curves and a full hairline so this is a great place to get started and get comfortable as well with plucking your um, units I only did a little bit you can go as far back as really you want to I try and do mine between like a half inch to a full inch and just kind of pluck sporadically just to kind of take out the bulk I'm not really trying to do a design with this hairline I'm just taking the bulk out We're just trying to like this is about the wig we're not talking about my whatever's going on back here next i'm just gonna use my red um gel to lay my hairline using darker wig caps you guys because I feel like I just try and get as close to my skin tone as possible I know a lot of people try and go close to their scalp but I always feel like whenever I do like a lighter um, wig cap the front part like that little band always ends up showing through especially if you are wearing a HD or clear lace unit I can never it just never like flows and i don't ever do the ball cap method you guys so I take my wigs off at night i'm thinking i'm actually thinking eventually i will do it um i'm kind of like curious just about it but i don't know all right y'all so i did use my combs i pretty much have always used my combs only when i'm doing a closure unit because i just feel like just this part for me is just not enough security so next i'll be using two new products you guys oh my goodness i'm finally using something new i've actually had these for a second i just remembered i've had these since like march and you know you order so much stuff from amazon you just forget what you have um, but i'm gonna use today the evan or even evan whatever you want to call it um wonder lace bond i'm gonna try this for my adhesive for my lace and then i am going to use my nairobi rapid foaming lotion this is my first time using this as well which is this is nothing new this has been around for forever so yeah let's go ahead and get this laid on melted whatever you want to call it and finish up this super easy look I 
stick with what I know because I know it works amazing. You know what I mean? And I'm just like, why mess up a good thing? But you know, you gotta, you gotta try new stuff. And because I'm nervous, I would just use my bed head hairspray on top of this, just like right on the edges um, to make sure it's all nice and secure. why I never you guys never see me do my makeup before I put my wig on but today I was like we just switching things up with the new products and stuff might as well just switch it up with how I do everything and I shouldn't have um, because now I have this like line right here and it's just always so hard to blend it gets cakey if you don't do it right and all that kind of stuff <sighs> so there's that so now we gotta figure that out starting from the very end working my way up then I'm gonna spray it with the tiniest bit of water and then add this um, foam lotion and I may hit the um, part area with my hot comb just a bit I'm not the biggest fan of using hot combs on curly hair especially right in the front because I feel like if you don't get it right which I don't always do it can end up looking like just Ugh, like super straight here and then it's curly and I just be like who walks around like that it's like a dead giveaway that you're wearing a wig
all right you guys so this is the final look it has been a minute it's been so long since i have worn hair this curly and this long but i love the outcome i was like oh look at me <laughs> but yeah the hair is actually really pretty i am i don't want to say i'm surprised but you never know what you're going to get with these companies like i said my first time working with love muse i'm not disappointed at all here's another big thing for me i do love the fact that most of the hair except for like these few little pieces like right in the front it's all one length a lot of times when you do like longer lengths or used to i guess it's been a minute since i've worn it you would just get such a drop off where the lace is and then the rest of the wefted hair it just would never blend really well and this to me blends really well i think they did a really good job you guys i did get some shedding um i don't want to say it was a turn off for me but i just want to let you guys know this hair did shed more so when i was washing it so it could have been a combination of detangling the hair i did pre i did pluck the hair as well so those shed hairs were coming out too but as far as like once i got all the loose hairs out and everything like that this is how much hair ended up coming out of my little detangling brush um as i was styling it right here which to me is not a lot at all i actually have an event coming up i'm gonna be in dc this weekend with my sister just for like literally the weekend and i didn't know how i wanted to do my hair but i'm thinking about just wearing it like this you guys i think i'm just gonna Mm -hmm. anyways you guys that is it for this video thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to check the description box everything that you need all the information on this unit will be down below and any other products that i use um let me know if you guys have any questions comments make sure you hit that thumbs up button and that is it thank you guys so much for watching i'll talk to you in my next one